Uh, the president held a dinner at his home in New Jersey yesterday. He held that dinner with business leaders. Nicole, come on in, please, because you've been talking to one of the CEOs who was at the meeting, at the dinner last night. What can you tell us about it? It's very interesting. No one knew what the president would discuss with these CEOs. I spoke with John Katsimatidis, and he's a billionaire. He's very patriotic. He's the head of the Red Apple Group. He's known for oil and real estate. And they discussed an array of topics. But here are some things that really stuck with him on immigration, China, Mexico, and oil. Here's what he had to say on immigration, that the president may actually do executive orders that would open up legal immigration for types of jobs that America needs for U.S expansion and not deport some of the college students that can actually help America. On China, he said that the, that the president wants to do a China deal. China is very anxious, but the deal has to be right. Also with Mexico, a deal is getting close. Lastly, that the president of the United States wants oil prices lower. No one knew what they'd be discussing, but he's self-made. He's very patriotic. He puts his time and his money uh, on making this country better. And this is what we heard directly from him from the dinner from Bedminster last night. So we'll see what comes up. And I also heard about 5% GDP growth. That'd be great too. So oh, let's yes. continue to have this country grow. Lest we forget, 5% growth predicted by the president. All right, Nicole, thank you very much for joining us. We'll see you again shortly, I promise.